All right, student loans may be bad for your love life. A new study shows that the more student loan debt a woman has, the less likely she is to get married. The researchers at the University of Wisconsin found the same does not hold true for men. Financial professional Kathy DeWitt Dunn from DeWitt and Dunn here with more on this study and other financial factors you should consider in a relationship. This sounds so antiquated to me. I know, Kathy. Doesn't it? It's just amazing. But I mean, so what's the deal? Why do you think student loans, the debt, keeps a woman from getting married? Well, I think one of the things is, is that typically a man does not want to marry a woman that has a lot of debt. And then also a woman isn't interested in getting married until she's reduced her debt. She's looking to empower herself. So it's a very interesting statistic. So the woman doesn't care if the guy's got debt, though. I know. It seems a little unfair, doesn't it? <laughs> Money problems can certainly ruin a relationship, even marriages. So besides debt, what should couples be talking about financially? You know what? That's really an interesting question. I think a lot of people have a difficult time talking about finances. And um, on my website at annuitywatchusa.com, I have a very interesting test for everybody to take. It's a financial compatibility test. And it kind of shows them what they should be doing and how they should be doing things differently and talking about the you know the debt word no one wants to talk about that at all so you know you really need to take a look at your debt and then take a look at the b word budget and people need to sit down get a budget together and be honest about it because and it can change through the course of the marriage i mean i've gotten a big old fight for after 22 years however long i've been married yesterday i know and you know one of the things too at self.com i couldn't believe the statistic 56 percent of women and 37 percent of men lie to each other about money in marriages mm -hmm. and that really causes some problems okay i have to go back to the study before i let you go because i know there are a lot of people on twitter that were going crazy and sending oh, yeah. messages about this segment yeah. because they feel like, oh my gosh, I'm stuck. I'm in graduate school, I've got debt, and now I have no chance to get married. What advice do you have? I really think you need to set a budget, you need to live within it, and you need to pay yourself. You need to also take a look at putting money in savings. I know that's really difficult, but you need to live within your means and you need to be true to yourself and honest. And then you also need to look for love. And you know what? You just need to take a look. Studies don't mean everything and, and everybody will find somebody. And don't pass up a good thing. I right? know, it's very difficult. But you know, <laughs> what is an thinks. interesting statistic, isn't and it? And thank you for sharing that quiz that we can all get on the website and check out. So you can also watch the segment online if you need to get that couples quiz. Go to cbsdfw.com. Once there, you will find the link attached to video of this interview. Thanks again Thanks. for being here.